there guys welcome to this video tutorial for JM Ember our latest release with um, Jubilerman this video tutorial here is I'm just going to show you guys how to um, create the one page option because if we go to the home page of Ember here I'll just show you quickly so this is the default home page if we click around here we can go to the different pages um, so we've got a standard Joomla menu here so if I go back to the home page again and then if we scroll down the page you'll actually see just uh, wake that up again there oh, there we go so you'll see now we've got the the parallax option the options of the different color the different rows for this theme on here so a very nice theme as well but what we've also done is we've installed a one page option so if we go home one page and then you'll see here there's no home button here you'd have to click the, the the logo to go back but if we click the our services you'll see how the page jumps down to where we where we're telling it to with the different um rows that we've put in there so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to show you how to configure this so that you can actually um, create your own menu link here and then it will jump down to the specific area of your theme that you're telling the template to do this so again if i just uh, refresh this page here so what I'm going to do, we've got About Us, Services, Latest Work, Teams, Pricing, Contacts. I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to pick another uh, another row here that we haven't got here. So we haven't got one for clients. So you can see in the menu here, we haven't got a link for the uh, recent clients. So I'll create a new one for that. So what we do is if we go to uh, the administration panel for your install, and then if we go to menus, and what we've done here is we've created a new menu and it's called one page so if I click on this here you'll see in here we've got the new uh, menu well the menu links in here for the for the actual um, one page theme that we've got here so I'm going to create a new one so if we go new and then I'm going to call this um, recent client well I'll just call it clients for now. let's call it clients uh, the menu type is an external URL so all we do is a select external URL so I'm going to click that there and then at the moment I'm just going to put in here I'm just going to put a hashtag now just to uh, show you how this works if I save that and then if we go to the front end of the site again and give that a refresh you'll see here now we have a new menu link there clients but there's nothing happening with this because we haven't put in the correct uh, menu link into there so I'm just going to explain how this menu link works so if we close this now and then we go to extensions template manager and then within the template manager here we've got the uh, the different temp uh, templates that we've set up on here so JM Ember one page so if we click into this theme here and then we need to go to the layout tab and then what you've got here is you can see the name of each row within your theme here so we've got FP about users fp process fp clients so it all depends on what row you've got created here so if i just drag this text file in here you'll see the link that we've created so for every menu link on the one page we have a, a, a prefix called hash, hashtag sp and then we have a, a hyphen to, to, to replace any spaces that we have in there and then we've got fp space about so if I find the about, so you'll see that here, that's FP about. So it's the prefix, space, FP, and then we put in the hyphen to replace the space, about. And then at the end of that, we always put hyphen wrapper. That's the suffix that goes at the end of each link. So all I need to do in here is I need to find what our clients is called. So it's called FP clients. So I'll just get that there. And then all I need to do is change that to clients and then when i go back over here so if i close this now and then go back to our menu and then go to the one page menu and then we go on to clients click onto that there and then remember all i've done there is change that to clients so we've got put that in there so we've got the suffix uh, the, the prefix which is the hashtag sp space fp space clients and then the suffix which is space wrapper and if we just save that there and then if we refresh the uh, the home page, the one page home page, and then we click the clients, 
you'll see there that, that scrolls down so that's just a quick easy way to uh, create the individual links for your menu and then the parallax scroll straight down for the one page Joomla theme so hope this was helpful if you have any questions please don't hesitate to contact us over at uh, support at or in the forum at joomlaman.com thank you very much